five common mistakes you need to avoid when it comes to cross body lead. Let's go and start with the first one. Woo! <laughs> Mistake number one. Number one. Angacht. <laughs> so I call it the Angacht, okay? Don't do that. So we don't lead with the left. No. A big sign for her that she needs to cross is by giving her space. Already that is a leading. Exactly. We don't need to use our left arm to lead her. Instead, what I do, if I cross bed one here, I lead a little bit with my arm. So from here. Okay? But just a little bit. But as, because, I, as I said, if I cross back, she has enough space to cross. Okay? And that's it. Please, no on guard anymore. Okay? Mistake number two, we don't want to go close, too close to our dance partners, especially when it comes to step number two. Look, step number two, which is one and then two, that's what I see the most. Guys are crossing diagonal and then So instead of doing that, we go with our one, normal, one, we go to the Side. So basically everything I do as a guy, as a leader, we uh, move here, lateral, lateral, okay? So we don't go to this place, no, it's her place, it's her dance space, so I go two, three. So to do it correctly, one time, five, six, seven, one, two, three, and five, six, and seven. From here, five, six, seven, one, two, three, and five, six, seven. In a close position, five, six, seven. One, two, three, and five, six, seven. As I said, we don't want to do this. One, two, three. And then we have a problem, okay? Even the four, five could be a problem even to lead her into the cross by lead. So, mistake number two, please do not be too close to her, to your dead spot. Mistake number three, don't break the flow. Look, we don't do this. Five, six, seven. One, two, three, and five, six, seven. One, two, three, and five, six, seven. No, no. You can practice at home doing that. So imagine this is Tasia, and now I make my cross body, which is one, two, three, and five, six, seven, here again, one, two, three, and five, six, seven. You see that I'm in the flow dancing in the line, yeah? So we don't break the flow. That's what you can practice at home. I do that, or how I do it is, if I do the, my one, two, three, which is one, two, and three, my three is looking already into the side, and I cross with my five. So it's one, two, three, and I cross back. So if I do one, two, three, and I wait until she's crossing, no, okay? So that makes no sense and we, we dance like robots. So in order to, to make or to have more flow, we cross back for instance, yeah? One, two, three, and five, six, seven. One, two, three, and five, six, seven. Just try to practice first alone and then with your dance partner. Now Tassi is here, watching, all right, in the close position, five, six, seven, one, two, three, and five, six, seven, one, two, three, and five, six, seven, one, two, three, and five, six, seven, and one. Tip number four, don't lead like a T-Rex.
you see this is too close and the whole posture of the of the lady is going like this okay so we open up our chest and our dance position so a good tip if you're like in this dance position and you want to open up then I go like that so okay you see this is the distance so don't do this and it looks even more horrible if you dance and she's crossing look five six seven one two three five six seven one two three a really common mistake I would say this is one of the biggest I've seen guys leading like a T-Rex okay this was mistake number five uh, this was mistake number four no? mm -hmm. so guys and now mistake number five not giving enough space for her I'll give you an example one two three and five six seven one two three and five six seven in order to do that always imagine that her line is free we don't need even my hands okay so if I wanted to cross I go one two three and she has enough space especially when it comes to cross by the inside turns or outside turns we want to give or walk through we want to give her enough space and that's what I see the most that with guys don't give enough space and then the ladies are thinking okay should I turn because there's not enough space look and what I mean is just so if I go like that now she needs to go exactly there is no other way for her so there is just maybe little little millimeters which decides okay this would be enough okay also um, including her shoulders they need to go through as well so don't be too close yeah so this is mistake number five give her enough space we don't need to lead action across by the lead if we give enough space okay so let's do it five six seven one two three five six seven one two three and six seven and a one two three six seven you see given enough space is the biggest sign is the biggest sign to uh i didn't cross i didn't okay guys try to think about it to try to avoid this when it comes to your cross by elite platzwechsel in germany we say and uh, thanks for watching. <laughs> you want to say something? No. Bye bye. That's the feel it. So guys, instead of leading with my left, yeah, that's the um. I swear now. Hakimi. But I have to do this first. I'm God.